is that? This feels bigger than that flathead. It's pulling the boat. Covers your entire chest. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even see your shoulders. <laughs> Ooh, T-Bounder, looky there. He did not crush that by any stretch, but there's a good one. There's a nice Trinity chunk on that crushed 25, no rattle. There is zero wind out here today, but it's overcast. That black and blue, I caught a huge bag on it earlier this fall. I don't think there's the potential for that kind of fish in, in here, but we can definitely catch numbers, so hopefully we're onto something. got another one dude holy cow that was the next cast that i have another one of these exact baits in there if you want it and you can put it on you can put it on that surinoy one see it's got a clip on it you just have to unclip it take that medium diver off and you can put this one on seriously though that see the see the one with the medium diver on there there's another one dude you need it, dude. Put the shad one on and see. See if we're on to some. Oh, I think he got off. Nope, he's on. He's running right at me. That's a spot. Look at the red eyes on that thing. He got a, he's got a sore on him, though. Look at his mouth, dude. This thing might be diseased. He had real red eyes. I'm going to try to take that rod and, and, and throw the, sh the same square bill, just a shad color, and see if. See if the black really makes a difference or not, or if it's just the action of the square bill. Got one. Dude, that one's tiny. That's another little spot. If the Trinity have small mouth, I'd imagine they'd look a little bit like that. Be a little small mouth, a little spotted bass there. This crankbait, man, is perfect for today overcast so the dark color contrasts real well there's dead it's dead still though so it's silent that little action or i mean that the, so i mean the action is actually pretty intense but the little profile works really well in the river i think i've never had much luck with bigger baits here so i think we're on the deal oh dude that's a bass what the heck <laughs> Dude, they're chasing bait like crazy, man. You would think this is perfect conditions for a topwater here, but anytime I've ever fished topwater here, it could be spring, it can be summer, it could be fall. If there isn't a little bit of a ripple on the water, if there's not wind, they won't touch anything. Like it would have to be like a fluke with no action coming across the water for them to hit it. Because if there's any action when there's no ripple on the water, they won't touch it. Like. And then as soon as you throw a bottom bait or a crankbait, they'll crush it. I don't know what it is. If I'm at like six to eight fish though and you still haven't got a bite, you probably need to put the black one on. <laughs> oh dude, and I had one chasing it right there. It was, a, it was just a little spot again, but there's another one. That's a bigger one. An actual largemouth at least. That's a slower uh, ratio reel. So you're gonna you need to burn the hell out of it because i'm i'm burning this one and it's like a seven one to one i'm sure that they would eat the the normal size square bill too i have a black and blue 50x that has a little bit of a rattle they might get pissed at that rattle too it's very subtle though it's not a loud rattle at all six cents makes an xr model now though they have their faint rattle that's been their what they've always produced and now they have an extra rattle square bill and other crankbaits too they have like big knockers in them well on the way back we'll have to fish this line since there's so many fish through here we'll have to fish that that bank there he is he came off of that cover whatever that was nice one Damn. 
clips are sticky. Nice one. I think that's number seven. I might have deleted a little spot off of there. He got one of the hooks just a little bit in his gill. It was bleeding just a little bit. I'm gonna let him go quick. Still on that black and blue square bill. Crush 25. The lyrics are bad. Like, I've never heard him make bad lyrics, but the lyrics are bad. Meaning he probably didn't write them. I just got a huge bite right there. He got it again. <laughs> that was awesome. He hit it once. I let it stop. And then he ate it as it was floating back up. The little ones always feel like they're biting it harder because they can't get the bait all the way inside of their mouth. The giants are just like a, like a little tit because they literally just like, they suck the whole thing down into their, that underspin bite the other day, I, like I hardly even felt it. And I just saw the line moving a little bit. Got one? Yeah, Preston's on the board. Keep him in, keep him pinned. Little large mouth, little river large mouth. That's number nine total for us, nine or 10. But that's your first one. <laughs> you skipped my bait though, you put it where you wanted it. You actually got one? You got a good one? Let's go. Damn, they're on Preston's bait now. Dude, that's a big bass. Come on now. That's a big bass. Oh my god. You alright, just, just let him tire himself out. He'll float up. Holy sh making drag runs on you. Oh boy. That's like a that's like a 20 inch bass. He's digging that hard, he won't come up. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> I just hope he doesn't get down there in the rocks. He's probably pissed. He's like, I can't go anywhere. That the rod just gives with him every time he tries to make a run. Dude, nice fish. Yeah, I think he's done. Nope. Not quite. Oh baby. Look at the fat lips on him. Lippy. Nice fish, dude. Oh, look at that river chunk on the black and blue 25X. Fat tub. Nice one, dude. Nice. There's a, there's a good one, Preston. He inhaled it. Oh. What do y'all think? Is that a myth when they say, oh, the inside of their mouth's all beet red, they must be eating crawfish? No, not sure if I believe it, but I'm using something. It's painted up to, to look like a crawfish though. Got a decent one, not near as big as the one Preston did. It's like 75 degrees out right now, it's December 10th. Hot, cold, hot, cold, hot, cold. All of them have come on that. We're gonna catch 20 fish on these today. Preston's throwing the same thing. Huh? Oh, damn. That's bigger than the one that I caught back there, isn't it? Look at that one. He got a hook hole in his body net. He's not the, not his first rodeo. Little crankbaits slaying again. There's a good one. What is that?
What is this? <laughs> Dude. No. Dude. <laughs> Dude. He came out of the water like a bass. Oh. No. <laughs> oh, man. Don't let him break my line, Preston. Well, well, no, he ate it. Just pinch, pinch him by the bottom lip. Nice. <laughs> Here. Look at his belly. Holy cow. Look at the belly on that thing. <laughs> That's probably like, what, an eight pound flathead? I think he thought that was a, a good idea. He got that all the way. Not like bad all the way, but that came out. Big old shovel head. <laughs> Look at that. Six pound test, man. I can tell you those flatheads are strong and that is a healthy one. He has been eating. I'd rather catch that than a big drum, don't you think? Yeah. Look how they can't, I mean, that water, I bet he, he's just like, you can't see him down there. He probably eats everything. <laughs> Egon. That fish put enough pressure on the button that it, dude, what is that? This feels bigger than that flathead. It's pulling the boat quite well. He's not, he, he's not coming up anytime soon, whatever that is. I'd rather keep him out here in the main channel away from all of this stuff. What is that? Oh yeah, he's, he's so tired, right? He's not tired because I don't have him by the head. He can do whatever the hell he wants to do. I caught one in January that was just gigantic. And this is probably every bit of that one. And he's gonna run every single time I get close to him. Ah. Holy, that is a mammoth. <laughs> Y'all see that? This is not doing it any justice right now. Wait until I hold this thing up. Like, y'all, I know way this fish is so heavy. This is bigger than the one I caught in January, I think. It is, <laughs> this is over 40 pounds. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> he just broke his freaking back, brother, dude. Look at this thing. Does it even fit all in the frame? It covers your entire chest. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even see your shoulder. <laughs> Behemoth's going back into the river. Oh my god. <clears throat> He's got to be damn near dead with as hard as he fought. Nope. <laughs> <laughs>